Hey guys, Matt Gibbs here. So, quick lesson for everybody. Uh, before me I have two Hitler Youth Knives. Um, both of them German made. Both made in the 40s. Okay, But one of them was made pre-1945. One was made post-1945. So you look at these and they look very, very similar. And the reason they look very similar is because they were both made by the same German manufacturers who made the original Third Reich period knives. So looking at these two knives, uh, from a layman's standpoint, they look almost identical. And, and for all intents and purposes, they are. However, <clears throat> a couple of differences that will help you identify a legitimate HJ knife from a post-war HJ knife. Legitimate HJ knives were marked usually with either an RZM marked or an early maker mark. Sometimes both of you are dealing with a transitional and there were knives that were not marked at all. Okay, typically later war knives um, were completely unmarked from time to time from certain manufacturers. Um, so how do you tell the difference between these two? Okay. Um, the one thing that's going to be a dead giveaway, and even on the German-made pieces, you can see on this one, it says Soligen, Germany, in English. A pre-1945 knife, these were never made for export, is never, ever going to be marked Germany. The other thing is, even if they were to remove that marking, Frequently on post-war knives made in Germany, you see squirreling markings on the Ricasso. Markings that have nothing to do with anything. And this particular one is marked GCCO420. 420. 420 being the stainless steel purity used in the blade. It's very, very common to see squirrely markings um, on post-1945 German-made knives. You look at these two knives, they are almost identical. This is a late war knife, it probably made 43, 42. Um, this one was made after 1945, probably late 40s. Um, both are German made using the same materials, using the same machinery. Um, that's why they look so similar. It's a minefield out there. Be very, very careful. You know what you're buying. And if you don't know what you're buying, know who you're buying from. Thanks.